How are you, sexy biscuits, and welcome into Mountain Blade Bannerlord 2. <laughs> I, forgot, I forgot the two. You put it in there somewhere, I'm sure it'll fit. I need to give a massive thank you to the PR company Bastion, who provided me a code on the PS5. I loved Mountain Blade 2 Bannerlord when it came out on PC, and I also got to play this version at Gamescom, and I had an absolute blast. I'm really happy to actually be able to play a console version of Mountain Blade 2 Bannerlord. But without further ado, we're going to jump into a new campaign and see what this is like. Okay, so we're going to choose our character's culture. We have the Vlandians, the Sturgians, the Empire, the Batanians, the Kuzites, and the Azari. I, I hope I said those right. I tried to say them as epically as possible. In a world. <laughs> you, you need to add a bit of gravitas. I think I'm going to go... For the Batanians, the Batanians still remember the olden days when the woods stretched across northern Colradia and the Empire and its cities had yet to violate their sanctity. The fierce warriors remained loyal to their traditional ways. They paint their faces when going to battle and even noblemen prefer to fight on foot while using the great axes and two-handed swords with deadly efficiency. We're gonna go for them. Uh, I don't know if that's a good one, but that's the one I'm gonna go for. Here is our character. He is called Jeffina. There she is. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out how to rotate Jeffina. It's not working. Um, I don't know how to do that, but I think she looks pretty good as she is. I might give her different hair. I like that one. There you go. She looks she looks super fancy. So you can change a lot of details, actually. The character customization in this is really nice. Um, yeah, you can add weight as well. That's so cool! I was born into the family of bards! So we have 10 skill levels and one focus point to roguery and charm, and one attribute to social skills. I like that. We're gonna go for that one. In my adolescence, I gathered herbs in the wild. As you guys know, I love gathering herbs and weeds in Kingdom Come, so we're gonna go for that one. In my youth, I trained with the Hearth Guard, so I know how to fight. I have a point in riding pole arms, and I also have a point in endurance, so that's useful. And in my young adulthood, I uh, had a famous escapade in town, so people know my name, Jeffina! Like many families in Colradia, your life was upended by war. Your home was ravaged by the passage of army after army. Eventually, you sold your property and set off with your father, mother, brother, and your two younger siblings to a new town you'd heard was safer. But you did not make it. Along the way, the inn at which you were staying was attacked by raiders. Your parents were slain, and your two younger siblings seized. But you and your brother survived. Because... I rode off on pebbles. Yeah, there you go. Rode off on a fast horse. We ran away. <laughs> that's, that's, that's my legacy. I ran away. Right, perfect. So there she is. It's Jeffina. Um, and uh, yes, we are looking all over the place in terms of our skills, but let's hope it works. I think we're getting close. We need to think about what happens when we catch them. How are we going to rescue our brother and sister? The wind's really loud! I can't hear you! I'll send you a word There's a band you. playing behind me. Shut up! Look, no, mate, I don't need a tutorial. I'm fine. I know how to play video games. I'm A-OK. -okay. Are you sure about that? I, I am. You, you said don't worry about it, right? I, I can't actually hear you. But yes, I'm fine. A few hours after you leave the training ground, you come across a wounded man lying under a tree. You share your water with him and try to dress his wounds as best as you can. He tells you he is a traveling doctor. I am the doctor. No, sorry, I watched Doctor Who recently. He hands you a small bronze artifact. On the first day of summer, 1084, you found an artifact of t Tactios. <laughs> It's coming up to Christmas, guys. So silly me, I didn't actually read what we were naming here, so um, I have no clue. What are we, na are we naming our horse? Are we naming our faction? What are we naming right now? Uh, I'm going to call it Blarb. No, uh, Furby. Actually, I can see Furby. He's looking straight at me. So um, I will call it Furby. Select my family name. Oh, oh, it's my family name. <laughs> Oh! Oh yes! My name is 
Jaffina Furby. So we can zoom in and out with the uh, triggers, which is nice. Uh, let's go to our first town. This is Tavia. Um, and let's see what happens when we go there. There we are. Riding about. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh, I love the look of this game, honestly. It is really, really nice. Look at this. Ah, oh, I was blown away when I first played Mountain Blade. Because I was like, oh, okay. So it's like a strategic game. There's not going to be any, like, third-person stuff. And then, obviously, there is. Um, and, yeah, this game really does pull it off so well. Whoa! All right, bloody horse! God damn it! Get off the horse! No, stop punching the horse! Get off the horse! <laughs> Toggle camera mode? Oh, my. First person? Ah, oh, that's amazing. Oh, I hope Arian of Tevia is a plan to get that out to market. Yeah, same. Oh, my apologies, madam. I hope it was something. Uh, no, thank you. Good day to you. Is this the mayor? Oh, ain't on Tevia. He's honest. There's no denying that. I'm sorry, I thought you were someone else. And look at that. You can even see a body. Eat that bloody Fallout 4 in Skyrim. <laughs> God damn it. So for those of you wondering, this game does have a performance mode, uh, which runs at 60 FPS at dynamic resolutions. And you also have a fidelity mode, which runs at 4K at 30. Um, personally, I'm going to use performance because I love myself some 60. Oh, I'm Arian. I've lived all my life working on the land, as do my kin. A lot of the people here in Tevia, the common farmers and craftsmen like me, they like me to speak for them. If you're going in the direction of Jalmari's, maybe you can take our herd there to Matha the Woolweaver. I'm willing to pay 900 gold if you deliver them safe and sound. Oh, is there any other way? Well, you can assign a companion with eight men. They will be enough too. Both ways work fine for us. And I promise you, if your men manage to deliver the herd safely, I will pay you 900. Uh, so currently I don't have any men. I don't have an army. I have myself. And that's it, so. Don't worry! I will deliver your sheep personally to Math of the Wool Weaver in the Almaris. Thank you, madam. The village will be grateful. Good luck. If we do go to our inventory, you can see we have... Ten sheep in there. I just shoved them in my pockets. <laughs> Get in there, you bastards. So, we need to head to Yal... 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 Yalvari. Yal... Yalvari. Where is Yalvari? <laughs> I should have asked, shouldn't I? I should have been like, Hey, where's this Yalvari you speak of? Oh, Yalvari! That's not how that's pronounced at all. I was saying that completely wrong. Yalvari! <laughs> okay, let's go! Oh, that's a long way. That is, um... Oh, oh no, no. Really? Do you mind speeding it up a little bit, Jaffina? Jesus Christ. Maybe if we double-click on it, she'll go really quick. You're right there. Ow. This is a robbery. Bum. <laughs> I immediately get a robbery. <laughs> I should have hired some people, shouldn't I? Well, maybe we can work something out. All right. So how much do you value your life, then? You can have nothing. Goodbye! Oh, I need to attack them, don't I? Okay. There's only seven of them and 20 of me. No, there's just one of me. Uh, that's not good. Also, how do I change my weapons? I really shouldn't. Don't get off your horse. What are you doing? Right. Uh, oh, my God. Okay. Ha <laughs> ha! It's me, Jeffina, the ultimate fighter! You will not beat me in my- Ow! Stop hitting me with rocks, you bastard! Right. <laughs> Why? Why do they keep hitting me with rocks? Ow! Stop it! <laughs> oh! Oh, suck it, you dinguses! Now, what are you gonna do now, huh? Nothing, that's right. Yes, yes, throw your stupid rocks at me, you big old dingus faces. Oh, I have a shield. Oh, I didn't realise. Right, hang on. <sighs> Alright, can I change my weapon? I thought I had, like, a spear or something. Ha-ha! <laughs> it's me! Oh, 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 I just took a rock to the nose. Ow! Um, <laughs> right, let's... <laughs> ah! Oh, my God, I'm gonna die. I'm actually going to die. Um, right. No. Oh! 65 damage just got delivered there. Someone is not looking well. You know what? I think I might have this. Here we go. Hello, boys. <laughs> <laughs> it's the <to> death. <laughs> oh. After a painful day of being dragged about as a prisoner, you find a chance and escape from your captors. And they've stole my sheep. <laughs> they've stole my sheep. 
<laughs> you bastards! <laughs> oh, that's it. I'm making an army. Oh, I'm going to wreck them. Hang on. Do you think they still have my sheep? I'd like to recruit some troops, please. Yes, I would. I'd like to recruit this guy, this guy, that guy, this guy, that guy, and definitely not that guy. He sucks. You will be defeated by moi. Seven of you? Oh, there's how many of me? Hang on. There is um, there's no not six because I'm I'm almost dead. But there there's 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 five. Yes, five of me. So, I'm getting my sheep back, you bastard. Come here. What is it now? Hello again. Hi. I, I just came by to say, screw you and give my sheep back, you bastard. Charge, my minions. Char Charge. But I don't actually know how to control them. Ah! Go. No! Attack. A attack. Gu guys, attack. Oh, God. <laughs> I should have looked that up! I should have looked that up! <laughs> oh, I'm so stupid. Right, okay. Uh, they are kicking my ass. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, we're winning. Last guy. Here we go. Oh, he took a... Yes! Oh, screw you! <laughs> That's right, medieval teabag, baby. We got three back. Right, I just have to go buy some more, and then uh, I can say they're the same ones. I am Casio, the VCR manufacturer. I own the land around here. I s speak for many of the people. Well, I haven't heard of you, so... Yeah, but I already need some help with some problems. Well, I don't think you can help me. I think you may have other similar commitments that could interfere. Uh oh, right, yes, um, that's a point. Do you have any sheep I can buy? <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, no. Well, well, you're useless to me then. I will see you in court. <laughs> We need to buy some sheep to make up for the lost ones. Oh, hang on. Maybe if we go back to Tevia and tell him that I failed dismally. Been a while. Yeah. Yeah, it's been a while. Hi. Um, so look, um, I, uh, I ran in, I ran into some small issues. They're all dealt with though now. They're all dead. So that's positive. Don't expect your sheep to be delivered to that town you said that I can't remember the name of. Uh, I actually didn't even look it up before I left. <laughs> so you can trust me as the best courier in all of Calradia. They're all dead. Um, let's be honest. Oh, it's very fancy in here. Hello, everyone. You all right? Oh, it's me, Jeffina. Yes, the one, the only. Brilliant. Oh, the maidens of Umbrella are merry and fair, blotting their mischief with flowers in their hair. Teddy, and were I still a young man, I sure would be there. But now I'll take warmth over trouble and dare. You're right. Oh, you do your boogieing down. Oh, very fancy. Uh, I see you looking at me. Okay, that's your boyfriend. All right, I'll leave. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that was awkward. Right, uh, let's uh, let's go over here and steal these shoes. No, uh, could I sit in this chair? My head is missing and I don't know where it's gone. Um, uh, um, Jeffina, <laughs> that's my song. We're going to leave it here. If you want to see more, uh, comment down below. Um, I, I've really enjoyed this so far, actually. It's really fun. I'm going to have to get knowledgeable with the controls first. I really should have done that tutorial, but uh, I'm an idiot. Um, I love... Each and every single one of you. Thank you very much for watching. A big thank you goes out to Tailworlds and, of course, uh, Bastion, who sent me the code. Uh, thank you for being awesome. Uh, but until next time, that's me. Out. Bye, guys. <laughs>